The Bono Regional Minister, Mrs. Justina Ousu Banahene, is advocating for an increased moral education amongst the youth as a means of helping stem the growing moral decadence in the Ghanaian society. She made this call at a ceremony to unveil the Faith Tabernacle Church of the Assemblies of God Ministries at Abisim, a suburb of Sunyani. The youth of today seems to be Russian. Those of us who were born in the 60s and early 70s. If that you compare our life and that of those who were born in the late 80s, our fathers worked and worked and worked so they could raise money to buy wireless Akasanoma. But life was peaceful, it was enjoyable. Today, we have almost everything that human being wants to have, but we are not at peace. Why? Because the youth of today seems to be rational. And I wish I have some of you to be part of my administration so that together we can fix good morals and ethical value our social cultural value in our youth. Head pastor at the Faith Tabernacle Church, Reverend Joshua Kerry, attributed the status quo to leadership and societal failure and called for the need to appreciate moral values ahead of material possessions. It's unfortunate. I think that it's a societal problem. And I think that, like we said, leadership, it starts, every, everything starts with leadership. We are living in a society where people are no longer received and respected and recognized because of the mature values that they possess but by the the, 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 the weight of their bank accounts the quality of their pockets and so since everybody is fighting for a recognition when the youth see that that is what provokes the desperation uh, to be also to also make money so that they will be seen as successful i believe that there is more to success than just having money if all you have is money as a person i believe you are one of the poorest people to be on his part guest speaker at the function retired reverend moses smiler warns the youth to be patient and submissive to the older generation as a means of helping change the status quo we want to encourage youth in our generation that once you have fathers the fathers are there to guide the fathers are there to lead the fathers are there to instruct so that your ways and days ahead of you will be more prosperous than we have as the older generation. The minister used the opportunity to remind the congregation on the need to adhere strictly to the safety COVID-19 protocols as a means of curbing its spread across the region. Now be part of fixing Mother Ghana. Be part of fixing COVID-19. And we are here. You, know, you see us in the street. It is church day, so everybody is in mass. But we are the very people to uh, Monday to Friday. You see, and we have on mass. Are we helping to fight COVID-19? Now the third phase is coming. It's coming with force. So please, let us help in combating this COVID by being a little bit obedient and observe all the protocols. Reporting for Joy News. Anas Sabat. Sunyani.